I have problems. The heck you say? The first is, my memory is going to hell on me. Okay, what's your second? My second what? Hey, everybody! It's time for AI Tips with Jay! Sounds too good to be true, but Jay has got some tips for you. Totally free, you don't have to pay. It's time for AI Tips with Jay! AI Tips with Jay! Hooray! AI Tips with Jay! AI, 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 Tips with Jay. This week on AI Tips with Jay. Persistence of memory and retrieval augmented. Holy crap, this is a long title. And now here's me. I don't get paid by the word, pal. Thank you, free stock footage. If you've watched AI Tips with Jay for a while now, you might already know about our command line interface, or CLI, that uses our Pocket Grok library to allow you to talk to Grok from a command prompt. It even lets Grok perform operations on your computer. But there's a problem. Each request is isolated unto itself. What I mean by that is your second question can't refer to your first question because neither Grok nor Pocket Grok have any sort of native memory to retain the conversational history. Here, I've asked Grok to tell me the capital of Iowa. It's Des Moines. Everybody knows that. Now I'll follow up by simply asking, what's their population? This, the old version of our CLI, won't know because it doesn't remember that we were talking about the city of, er... Uh, Des Moines. Right, Des Moines. And so it will try and answer as best it can by grasping its straws and spitting out the populations of various countries in a futile attempt to appease its benevolent human overlords. America's only in third place? For now. But we've made up a lot of ground the past three and a half years. This message not paid for by any candidate or candidate's committee. So to fix Grok's short attention span, we've upgraded the Pocket Grok library and given it the ability to retain conversations as well as any documents submitted via our new Retrieval Augmented Generation, or RAG features. Here, I'm updating our CLI script to take advantage of these new persistent memory functions. Once again, we'll ask it for the capital of Iowa. And again, I'll ask them what their population is, without specifying the name of the city in question. Which we all know by now is Des. It's not Des, Moy, Nez, you spaz. It's Des Moines. Des Moines. Then you spelled it wrong. Anyway, this time when I ask it for the population, it will remember I'm talking about, um, that city in Iowa. And boom, there it is. Grok even remembers the things we talked about earlier in the day when I was testing various inputs in preparation for this video. And on behalf of Pocket Grok, it's been a pleasure chatting with you. Oh yeah, it's been peachy. Apple. Not your thing, cool take a hike. Otherwise, subscribe and like to AI Tips with Jay. AI Tips with Jay! Hooray! AI, 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 AI. AI. Tips with Jay. AI Tips with Jay is a copyrighted production of j.gravel.us. All rights reserved by AI Tips with Jay.